What's up everybody to a new video on the channel. Today we'll be reacting to a Jubilee video in which we need to find two people that are non-virgin. Before we want to start the video, I want to tell you to subscribe, to like, and comment if you enjoy watching these type of videos. Let's get into the video, Roy. Right? Yes. Odd Man Out, Season 4, Episode 6, Virgins. Why, why are you guys... Hey. So like, nice, Jesus! Ooh, yeah, <laughs> so like I was raised like... Same. Yeah? Yeah. Yes. yeah. Okay. The fact that there were four Christians kind of caught me off yeah. guard, so I kind of thought that one of our, the Christians wasn't a virgin. I grew yeah. up in a conservative <laughs> Middle Eastern family, okay. so we just didn't grow up talking about that, so I never felt comfortable, and I wasn't really confident in myself. I'm from like a Catholic family, so like Filipino Catholic family. There's no way that I could like ever have the thing. Plus, I'm also yeah. gay. I'm your two sisters. Yeah. <laughs> a sexual wow. It's like kind of on a spectrum, but um, yeah, just the lights are turning red. Oh yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. How old are you guys? Sure. 19, 19, 20, 21, 22, 24. <laughs> 24. Okay, so the people think that the moles are the guy with the sweater hoodie and the girl that I told you about, the girl with the white crop top. Okay, I, I'm curious. I'm very, very curious. Let's see. Let's see who will be voting out. Leah? Leah, Josh, Leah, Leah. She looked a little mysterious, yeah. and before the round started, we were informed that there were two moles, and she didn't really have a reaction to that. I voted for Leah because she didn't say anything. True. And also, she was the oldest. She didn't really give us much to go off of, so. Bye, Leah. I think it makes sense that people voted me out because I'm older. I don't think there should be that stigma on older people. Like, if you're older, you had to have sex, but it makes sense to me. Yeah. Did you have their first kiss? Yeah. 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 I actually oh. have not. No. 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 no just How keep it's waiting. Okay, yeah. Just wait. Yeah. How old are it's you guys? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. That girl said that she didn't have her first kiss and she's like 21 or 20. I was 15. I had it at Disneyland. How cute. 15? Okay, that's like 8th grade. That, that's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not judging anyone. I'm just talking here like in no man's business. I was 18 when I lost my kiss. First kiss? He said that he lost his first kiss and that was just a red flag in my head because I was like, I wouldn't say it like that. Uh, I was... 12. Oh, was wow. oh. <laughs> okay, okay, but that, that's so. Is that when I was in elementary school, all the guys were like talking to us, like, you haven't had your first kiss yet? And I was like, no. And then there's me. No? <laughs> I, 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 so then I get to high school and find out, oh, I guess I was way ahead of everybody. Mm -hmm. yeah. Have you guys yeah. done like, I'm trying to like stuff that. further than kissing, like oral sex? Like, I don't know what you guys consider like true sex but like, mm -hmm. yeah. like with my ex that was like a purely lustful relationship so like yeah so how did you deal with that <laughs> like how, oh. was he com like coming on to you and you were just like no it was or? more like because we were so like in each other's faces and it would just kind of like happened and mm -hmm. then right before like you know it would have crossed that line i was like wait wait, wait, wait hold on wait, wait, wait can we just okay because he was also a virgin he broke okay. up with me had sex with someone else we got back together he told me and then we broke up again Justin. That's a story and a half. Wow. So she told us that she had a boyfriend. They almost got into it, but they didn't. And then the boyfriend got with another girl hooked up, and that guy got her first. And after that, they got together. And after they got together, they got. Okay. And mentioned a lot of uh, close times with like losing, like almost losing her virginity, and like maybe she, I caught, maybe she was slipping. I <laughs> was dating someone that wasn't wow. saved. Yeah. And Same. that I That's really think that brings me down. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But when uh, no. there's not Jesus in the center. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's yeah, it's hard. hard to and it's God hard when your your relationships aren't when you're not focused on Christ. Your relationship with other kind of it brings you down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It does. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Yvonne. I would go with Eva here. 
losing his kiss. I didn't want to, but I, I had to vote for Jasmine. Josh, Yvonne. Yvonne. He was pretty, like, timid, and I just felt like he wasn't giving enough details to what he was true. saying. True. Very true. Very true. Oh, my God. Oh, bro. Don't break. Bro, fuck. Legs. I tried to talk and, like, say my look name. At his, look, name. look at his mouth. Like, like he's talking like this. Like, who does, t who talks like that? One was going over me. I just, like, sh shrank more down. I wish I talked more. <laughs> Raise your hand if you think I've been wasted in the box and I would like to continue. Who would do that? Yeah. Raise your hands, guys. What are some stereotypes that you guys think? That's what I was going to ask. This I'm just happened saying. at my work the other day. Like, Two of my coworkers were like talking in the back, and then I walked up, and they're like, "Oh, Rachel's here. We can't talk about this stuff because, <laughs> like, she's too like angelic." And I was like, "Guys, come on! That's like, I I know yeah. about everything." Yeah, it's people think that okay. like, as a virgin, that I'm like afraid of sex, mm -hmm. but best believe, <laughs> <laughs> wedding night, <laughs> <laughs> we ain't going nowhere Dude. that whole weekend. Yeah. I feel like for me is that people immediately assume I'm religious and waiting for a marriage but mm -hmm. that's actually not the case for me yeah. so mm -hmm. I, I feel like a little like I can't relate to you guys because I'm not technically waiting for marriage but I'm waiting to have a all of these people are waiting for marriage right here okay relationship with mm -hmm. the guy like I just want to be totally completely comfortable with yeah. him I would say other stereotypes that people have that bother me that we have no social skills or that we're not attractive or we d are super introverted. It's like, there's no right time to have sex. Everyone's on the yeah, right path. And that's true. Know, when the time comes, it comes. My religion is the main reason why I'm waiting, but also it just, it makes sense to, yeah. sh to wait to share that with somebody. That's the only person that's gonna share that with you. That's like, that's just something really special. Mm -hmm. I think go beyond religion. <laughs> Plus, yeah. you know, everybody has told me like they had a really crappy time the first time. Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. Like, I've gotten my heart broken just mm -hmm. like in a relationship. And I feel like if I had that like loss to somebody like that would hurt me. I hate, yeah. I hate yeah. that it's called like losing your virginity. Like I don't want to lose it. I want to give it. Yeah. Oh. I like that. Cause when you lose something, you don't intend to lose something. So in when you lose your virginity, it's like you never intended to like give yourself to sexually. And I'm willingly and like I want. I think to one one of the moles is out already. Someone, cause it's something that's sacred and mm. it's something that's really important to me. What you were saying about like other forms of sex, cause yeah. our stories are pretty similar. Yeah. Like I I also struggled with pornography as yeah. well, mm -hmm. and um, but God really freed me from that as well. It messed with my mind, it really did. It gives you this fake outlook on what sex is. Like, yeah. It's not real, sex. it's not yeah. sex. Like it's, that's just actors yeah. like mm -hmm. putting on a show. Yeah. I think for when guys get into that stuff, it makes them think of women as an object. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that they're just to be used True. for their pleasure. And I just, I think yeah. it's awful. So. And porn is yeah. so racist and sexist and yeah, all of the above. There's nothing like, good it's about it. It's just evil, yeah. it's inherently evil. Yeah, and yeah. I mean, the videos I've seen online, it's like, it's always like, yeah, open. That's black crazy. dude, black girl, like Asian girl, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Like it's trying to gain views through people's ethnicities yeah. and it really promotes That's stereotypes. Crazy. My parents didn't tell me to like, wait until marriage to have sex but they taught me especially my mom mm. like she was like live your own damn life first like explore get educated become successful then yep. like worry about men like i just feel like i've had mm -hmm. not a lot of drama in my life because i haven't dated Good. and honestly that like true. Not that's true like dating is it's hard it is hard yep you know i'm single but like <laughs> i've honestly like I'm really successful and I'm in a really great yeah. place and I learned to that's love crazy. myself first before I'm going to love someone else. Yeah, that's, oh, that's very good. Like, my mom like told me from when I was young, like, little, little like a little child, like that. Uh, if you love yourself, everyone will be able to love you. But if you don't love yourself, no one will be capable of loving you because you don't love yourself. Confidence is key. For Christians? Yeah. I mean, I don't have mine on I love I yourself. I my finger. But I have a purity ring. 
do you guys like have anything to like? No, I don't think you need to show it mm -hmm. and everything. It's not. She brought up purity rings and I feel like that's something purity that not too rings. many Christians do nowadays. So I thought maybe she was trying to pretend to be a Christian and that was one way. Yeah, I'm allergic to metal. Oh, and okay. so like jewelry is really <laughs> specific for me, so mm -hmm. like I just don't eat, like, yeah. I made these earrings, so like I know what's in them, awesome. but <laughs> yeah. other than that, like I don't mess with Wow. Them. Wow. Rachel and Josh. I just got these okay. from him that he had sex before and was like a reborn virgin. There were so many religious people in the group and I was like trying to get rid of one of them and the purity ring kind of made yeah. me choose her. Wow! The most still in here, guys. It's not me. Raise your hand if you think that the mole is still in the box, box. and you would like to continue the game. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Everyone, everyone is saying that they are Christians. The other guy with the shirt like is he saying that he got he was he got his first kiss or like at 12 but it's like crazy and you are a virgin still at how much like 21 he's 21 so nine years i, I like i th i think this shirt guy this shirt like especially for you guys because you grew up religious was sex like a taboo yeah, topic in your house. Like, did they ever talk? Like, look at his hands. Bees talk. Like, growing yeah. up. He's, he is nervous. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it was treated with respect, mm -hmm. but not. It wasn't like swept under the rug. It was He's talked about. Talking the truth. Wasn't, like, the truth. Yeah. Do it. it was just, they weren't like here's... super open about it. Yeah. 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 They were like, here's what it is. Here's what it's for. We kind of expect you to to oblige with that, but. Who is telling you here is what it's for? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Nice. I want to bounce back to what you said about like alternative sex. Mm -hmm. Like, what is virginity? No, it's like, like is is like oral that's sex? A good is that? Because some people are like, because I was like, like, over here sex, thinking and like, then some people are like, well, yeah, giving a hand job could be sex. Yes. You know? It's like. I guess that depends on the is person. Is it up to the person? Or I is would it say like, I because so, I think penetration. I don't know. I think it just depends on like the motivation or. I don't even know. I don't know. If it's not one definition, then it's like, like too like loose. Yeah, you know? it's, yeah. It, yeah. Subjectivity is weird. <laughs> yeah. I was gonna ask like your view on like sex, like sex education. Like, do you guys believe in abstinence? Like, no, 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 in school? Okay, me neither. no. Yeah, absolutely yeah. Absolutely not. Abstinence is like waiting, waiting, waiting until marriage. marriage. But like teaching that in school. In school. No. Yeah. I mean, I would they teach last. all. F no. Yeah. I teach everything. F no. Stress abstinence. Why? Like, no way, bro. I'm the safest. Abstinence no. Is not gonna help the problem. No. Mm -hmm. Like you need to teach safe sex yeah. and provide condoms and teach girls about birth control so that they're not Yeah, that's true. Pregnant. Yeah. Too young, mm -hmm. not yep. having the resources and you know, avoiding abortions yeah. and all of that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think and you should teach that but just stress yeah, yeah. Totally. True. I mean, the absence is the but you're not yeah, absence just, is already just like <laughs> just as a non religious yeah. person, yeah, like I get that. I don't agree with you on that. Yeah. But like respectfully disagree. Yeah. No, like, it's the same way. I, I feel the same way. Own. Like I literally, I'm just like, teach their own. If you do you, mm -hmm. like that's what makes you happy. Like awesome. Yep. Oh, man. This is really hard. I don't like it. The red lights. No, no, no. Rachel. Rachel, I noticed was sharing a lot less. less. Yeah, she's she not really talking. Rounds. Ricky. The Ricky. Abstinence thing. I know, guy. I know. Like is the only answer for him. Just kind of made me feel like he was playing the game too hard. Yeah. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Raise your hand if you're certain that the mole is still in the box and you would like to continue the game. Okay, come on. We will see. Come on, come on. Like it, it, they're red. They're red. A hundred percent. They're red. I, I know it. It needs to be the shirt guy with the uh, Christ. Red, red, red. Bro, where? Are Who are the moles? Wait, wait. I think, I think. Wait, 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 wait. Congratulations. I think, I think the mole is the girl with the blue hair and Yvonne or the girl. Oh! <laughs> Wow! I know, I knew Eva, Eva was for sure a virgin. Like she, 
Just Dang. one had to be like. I definitely learned that my like virgin radar is completely off. I am a born again Christian, so my strategy going to the game was to have the mindset that I do now, which is kind of twisting my truth. So everything I said had a lot of truth base to it. Oh, money, money, money. <laughs> wow, this is more money than I've ever held. I, I love to react to this vids again, so if you enjoyed watching today's video, guys and girls and toilets and tech nuggets, please subscribe and like and maybe comment if you want to say something. So thank you everyone for watching today's video and I wish you to have a nice day, a nice month, a nice year, a nice night maybe if you're watching it at night time, I don't know. And yep. Yeah. Peace.